I'm Andrew Perchuk. I'm the Deputy Director of the Getty Research Institute in Los Angeles and the co-founder of PST Art. And we're here with Freeze to promote PST Art, Art and Science Collide. So Candice Lin has produced these extraordinary Korean fighter kites dyed with hand-done indigo. One of the reasons we're so interested in Candice's work, it is such a perfect marriage of art and science. These are five kites that I made as part of the Freeze Getty PST collaboration. They are painted on silk with natural dyes and themed after my cat Roger and thinking about themes of castration, um, our relationship to animals and sexuality. And then when I thought about making kites, I um, wanted to work with Yao and Stevie Choi um, because I know they specialize in making these Korean fighter kites, which are unique in having this hole in the middle. So the process includes the armature, which is the bamboo, the skin. Oftentimes it's mulberry paper, but here we use silk. And she was really intrigued by the hole in the center, which is very unique to the Korean fighter kites. And it kind of went along with her um, research and castration and these other um, ideas that she's exploring. The title of the work is Feline Messages to the Human World. And um, some of the messages are on the kites like castration is still possible. And these are messages that Roger is giving to humans about possibilities and powers that come from being castrated. So in the workshop, um, which was co-taught with Stevie Choi, I talked a lot about the natural dyes that I've been making and using in my textile work. I showed people how to make three different inks, and then they drew on mulberry paper in this case because it was a little quicker for the workshop. Korean fighter kites were banned during the Japanese occupation, and so flying them was a means of resistance. But it, of course, also gets into the fact that they are a military technology. One of the things that really defines PST art and Candace's work is that though it engages with critical issues that humanity is struggling with now, it can also be a lot of fun. I think sometimes people have forgotten to play and enjoy and have fun, and it was really fun to watch the participants running around with their kites trying to get them to fly afterwards. <laughs> 